Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Sitting at minus seven. Tied for fifth. Opting for the nine iron. Yeah, that's a good line. That should find the surface. Gee, I think they've got the handle of this game, Rich. Fairways and greens. The iron play today has been absolutely stellar. Luke, the greens and regulation, just a fantastic accomplishment. Great to watch. A birdie putter waits. He's currently in a share of top spot. Another birdie opportunity lies at the par for 11th, but players must navigate the fairway bunkers. Tee shots must be placed on the left-hand side to get the best view and angle for their second shots as this green sits below the player and moves from left to right. Tee shots down the right might be closer, but it's going to leave a second shot over a deep bunker and making it that much more difficult to get close. Nicely done. Time for the second shot at the 11th. Oh, look at this. Right down the throat. Yes, any time you can find the green and have a putt, you'll take it. Oh, good look at Birdie here. Shame it didn't drop. A par putt awaits. Okay, let's head to the next. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Rich, this par 4 12th uh, really challenging, especially around the green. This tee shot is underrated in difficulty wise. This is not an easy tee shot as this fairway pitches from left to right. You want to skirt the bunker down the left hand side as best possible to find the fairway. Second shot from there goes straight uphill and surrounded by two of the deepest bunkers on the golf course as they say luke everything is bigger in texas and these bunkers are proof of that look at the line on this one get in the hole that's a terrific shot and sets up a birdie opportunity here at the 12th oh these are good for the momentum these ones right on eight feet he's staring down a birdie putt here Looking good. That's a lovely putt to make for Booty. Take some pride in that one. He finds himself in a share of the lead. 13's a long par three, measuring 245 yards, Rich, but it is playing downhill. Downhill to a sliver of a green, however. Anything missed out to the right will leave a very challenging pitch shot to a green that'll sit well above them come up short and those bunkers well that's no bargain either a three here well you done good feet to the cup looking for another birdie here Ooh. just a short putt remaining here trailing by a stroke after that hole what do you think of the 14th richard par five 575 yards this is a really good par five here luke Tee shot wants to favor the right-hand side of the fairway, if at all possible, shortening the hole some 20 yards. Second shot must avoid those fairway bunkers down the right and on the left-hand side. A narrow opening to this green should players go forward in two. Henny, how bad is this lie? 
Yeah, this ball's sitting up perfect. He's going to have a great light. Seems to have chosen the three wood. Yeah, this is lovely. I know it hasn't come up exactly how they imagine in their mind, Rich, but you've got to like that play. Distance control nearly impossible coming out of this rough. And this putt to move them into a tie for second. And a big moment for this player with just four holes left. Nicely played, moving on up the leaderboard now after that hole. As we start heading for home, Rich, we find ourselves on the tee at the 15th. Could be the hardest hole on the golf course, Luke. Tee shot must avoid that bunker down the right-hand side. Second shot is to a green that's perched above the fairway and surrounded by four bunkers that are mean. This hole could make or break a player's day. And Henny, what are you seeing down there? I'd say he's about 165 from this flag. Going with the seven. Oh, this would be handy if he could bounce right. Yep, that shot safely on the green. This putt is from 14 feet. This for back-to-back -back birdies. Oh, just missed. That's yeah, just about three feet away. And yet another putt drops, so now 10 under par heading down the stretch. Inching their way closer to the top of that leaderboard. Can't afford any mistakes from here on in. Going with the eight iron here. This is a good time to get hot with the tournament on the line. What have they got in front of them here, Henny? This one, guys, he's got around nine feet. This one has eyes for the hole. Oh, what a super shot. He's currently sitting in third. The 17th is certainly a fun hole. The question really is, should players go for it or lay up? Depending on where they put the tee box, Luke, most players should be going for this green. Anything just short and left could find that deep bunker fronting a green. But to be fair, that's not a bad miss. The one you want to avoid at all costs is the one on the right-hand side. Because nobody, not even professionals, like a 60-yard bunker shot. Get in the hole. Ouch, that hurts. This putt is for a share of second. Maybe we should make it. Tied going into the final hole. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. Well, while the closing hole at TPC San Antonio can be reached in two, Rich, it's all set up by the tee shot. Tee shot must find the fairway. If not, you have water hazards left and bunkers right that will gobble up that second shot if you're slightly out of position. And going with driver off the deck with this shot. Oh, come on. This would be a good one to hold. A chip for the tournament. Calm your nerves here. This is a must-make putt to force extra holes. Oh, that's a... Well, how about that, Rich? We're going to extra holes now. Well, Rich, it's time to find out who will win this in a sudden death playoff. Oh, everybody loves a playoff, Luke. I'm excited about this. Love this scenario, Rich. Extra holes, sudden death. Here we go. Oh, let's get into this. I can't wait. Well, oh, that sounded absolutely flushed. Second shot here on the 18th hole.
Nicely done. Getting ready to play their third. Lovely effort, that. And now this, to win the Valero Texas Open. What a great opportunity here for a look at a birdie. It was on a good line. It all comes down to this. Make it, and the playoff continues. The fans are certainly getting their money's worth with this playoff. Let's head to the next. We still need more holes to decide this one. Let's head to the next. Oh, that is crushed. Wow, Rich. That's impressive. Love them being aggressive on this par four. Great tee shot. Here's an opportunity to close out the Valero Texas Open. Don't you just love to see that? A big time putt at the right moment. It took them a little longer than usual, but what a way to win this one, Luke. Amazing putt. celebration started there's your winner and let's go join him luke winner on the second playoff hole well that should do it folks hope you enjoyed our extra coverage in this week's playoff finale from myself and all the dedicated talented people at 2k sports thanks for tuning in see you next time